I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Orchids to Dusk. Review copy of this game was provided by the developer. This is a game about exploration, let's call it. Uh, the game is networked. I believe it networks other people to join you on the world as you're wandering around. But I'm reviewing this early, so there's nobody else around. So I'll just cut the loading portion. There we go. It seems like if there's nobody to match make with, it just uh, crashes you after about 30 seconds. So the controls are simple. It could be called a walking simulator if you so choose. Um, one nice thing that I honestly wish more walking sims would have is that you can, um, well, for one thing, you can walk in one direction and move the camera around in another if you hold both keys. You can also walk backwards towards the screen, basically. Oh, lovely. Um, if you use the right button, and you can also, the feature I think more games should have, you can auto walk with just press K and you'll auto walk in whatever direction you're currently moving in. Uh, so we are an astronaut stranded on a planet. Oop, we got a little contextual animation there. Oop, let's stop walking. Uh, looks like we're not the first one, but that's fine. Isn't this place pretty? I saw some pre-release footage of this and I knew I just absolutely had to play it. Uh, this game is pay what you want, recommended price $5, but you can, uh, I believe you can download it free if you want and you can pay later if you decide it's worth it after playing. Um, if you sit down, I guess stuff just starts happening. That's neat. But hey, oh! Something almost happened. Let's let's explore around a little bit here. You know, what we really want, of course, is to find a way off this planet and, you know, find some more oxygen, see? We need to find some oxygen so we don't die. Sure is a pretty sky, though. Seem to be a vaguely female sort of carbon unit. Distant Parker knocking things around in the distance. Let's oops, get off that get off the tree. Get off the tree, friend. Um let's hmm. Rather empty planet in some ways. Aside from the one corpse. Said towards the trees. Things seem to be random. I um, are procedurally generated, I suppose. Um, I started this up just to test it and make sure everything worked. Uh, things were just a little bit different. Same general, you know, same aesthetics. Just things were in different places. Um, not sure if it's like a single multiplayer map or if it's pr actually procedurally generated. Like, it may just be a big map and you're randomly placed in. Because, I mean, procedural generation plus multiplayer doesn't necessarily make too much sense. But let's... we're getting around 50% oxygen. Maybe we should see if these trees have some nice oxygen in them. This planet sure doesn't. Oops. Nice little mountain or something over there. What do we got here? Just just some more trees. I guess these trees don't give us oxygen. Maybe these trees over here will. Maybe these trees will. Do is the draw distance was a bit better. Oh, that, that's another friend over there. Not entirely sure what this little meter at the bottom left is. Oh! Someone else's footsteps. Possibly the person over there to the left. 40% oxygen? You know, no, no, no reason to uh, panic. Everything's. Oh. Everything's gonna work out, unlike the uh, other three people we found. 
pretty little mountain over there. Or more of a spire than a mountain. But, uh... Oh, very lovely place. Oop, there's another one. It's a very pretty place to uh, die, at least. Isn't it? I'm sure a little astronaut friend here agrees. Coming up on 30% oxygen. You now maybe... Oh, nice little... Is this a bog sort of thing over here? Maybe we should just take a rest and sit down for a minute. Enjoy... Enjoy the nature. You know? Enjoy ourselves. I think that's like a stress meter, and while you're moving, it goes up and you use a bit more oxygen. I love that the, the camera sort of auto pans and things get a bit more vibrant. And it's like everything's going to be okay. Aside from the rapidly dwindling oxygen meter. So, uh... You might have gathered by now. Uh, you're gonna die. There's no winning this game. But, uh... It's a really nice place. It's a really pretty place to, uh, die. You know, it's... It's really hot here. Maybe I'll just... Maybe I'll just... 